Uh, my name is Adil Mohammad. Uh, I'm an international medical graduate from India. Uh, I matched into internal medicine program, categorical track in Michigan this year. And I'm very fortunate enough to have, have been taking uh, Sarthi's help. Um, uh, thank you, Sarthi, as well. And con congratulations to other panelists here who have matched this year. Um, uh, so now the theme what I'm going to talk about is how to find research in uh, reputed organizations in US. So firstly, it was 2019. Uh, when I was starting my journey and there was no research on my profile. So I reached out to many professors in reputed organizations. So no one was able to help me. So then I understood that the first thing is we have to help ourselves in order other to uh, other and then others will try to help us. So I reached out to many um, doctors in my home country and many cardio, I was interested in cardiology. So Many I approached many cardiologists and they gave me um, uh, some chance to work with them in some of the papers. We did work until two years and then we published around three to uh, three, four papers, three uh, observational studies and one case report. It was very helpful for me. And then I reached out to many uh, uh, professors in highly reputed organizations, so uh, highly reputed institutions. And then I said that I've been working on these things until now, and uh, I would want to collaborate with you, and I would want to work, and these are my skills. I've listed out all the skills in the email, and then I was reaching out to them. And in this process, I've, uh, I've made many mistakes. I've learned from my mistakes. So the main mistake was I was emailing many doctors uh, throughout the United States, but I was not getting replies. The, the one thing I got from one of the Sarthi panelists was, in my email, uh, this uh, this mistake, I was also doing this mistake, and I see many of my peers doing this mistake as well. So we only say that we need the position, and we are interested in the skill, uh, in this uh, kind of research. We are interested in cardiac arrest. We are interested in uh, atrial fibrillation, but we do not say, we do not appreciate their work as well. We do not state what they're doing in that field. So that was very helpful for me. Many Sarthi panelists told me that told me to include that as well in our email. So when we are emailing uh, doctors, we should also search about them on PubMed, search about them on the on their specific institutions, search them about them on Google Scholar, and also cite their articles and read their articles and understand what they're doing, understand how much they're publishing each year. So that will also be helpful for us in the long run when we are doing research with them on the, uh, in the organization. So when I included that part in my email, when I read those papers, when I uh, appreciated what they were doing, uh, when I said that this, I can come to your institution and, and I can help in those lines on those similar lines and make your work more easier. And that was the time I was, I was given an opportunity to interview with, uh, with the researcher, research faculty there, and I then got this position. So I would uh, highly uh, suggest all the applicants to do uh, do help yourselves first. If you don't have any research on your profile, try to get that research. You can find that anytime. Just reach out to people and then it'll be useful. Thank you.